Hey, you guys, welcome back to Crazy Quilt and Crafts with S.E.K. with another show and tell. All right, you guys, I told y'all I was on a roll when it came to crocheting this season, and um, I have conquered another um, pattern. Um, I haven't I haven't mastered it yet, but I remember I told y'all when I learned something, I binge on it until I get tired of making them. <laughs> All right? So, um, in my previous video, y'all saw the barefoot sandals, right? And I'm going to do my best to try to link um, these uh, videos to you guys just in case you guys want to learn how to make them. And over here, you're looking at a, a white and purple ensemble that I made. And um, I will link this video and I will link the video. I already know where I learned how to make these little cutesies right here. You guys, look at that. Look at that, you guys. So this ensemble has the barefoot sandals and the crochet um, uh, little headband. And I learned this from Bag, Bag O' Day um, Crochet. She is excellent when it comes to tutorials. She's up close and personal with her videos. You can see everything that she is doing. And I learned this little cutesy dress from her. And I will definitely link her. I learned the... Um, the headband, um, the pretty little headband from her, from her as well. And these little bows, I had these for a very, very long time, you guys. I added these in some other barefoot sandals that I did for women. And um, I just had these in my stash. I said, sometimes you don't even understand why you have things. And then something, something happens, you guys, and you wind up using what you have, right? So I told y'all I'm turning into a hot mess, as y'all can see. Y'all already know who these is for. Y'all ain't figured it out yet? <laughs> All right, so this is one that I did, and this is another one that I did. Let me move these out the way so you guys can get a close-up of this one. And it's so darling. Hold on, you guys. My fault. My light went out, so, but you, you guys could still see. So, um, this is what this one is looking like. And if you are a beginner or you are a novice, a novice will be able to bust this out in no time. Um, so, I have done... Oh, let me show you all the sandals. So, I added these little, um, little plastic um, adorable flowers to it. After I did it, I said, oh, shoot, I should have used the other purple ones, but that's okay. It gave it a, um, another dimension of look, and this is the other um, uh, head bow, head wrap, well, headband, 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 and that's the ensemble over there, and that's what that looks like, and um, again, a novice or a beginner can do this. And again, Bago Day, give credit to her. Excellent crocheter. I've learned several things from her. She is definitely excellent and uh, very precise. All right, you guys, let me see if I can get my light back on. Bear with me, you guys. you guys sorry about that I just wanted to get my light back on so you guys can continue to see hold on all right hold on you guys Alright you guys, we back. Real life, real time, real situations. There we have it. <laughs> Alright family, so again, bag of the day. Bag old day. Crochet. And again, very, very um, thorough. She's very thorough with her um, instructions and very close up and personal. So if you want to learn how to do this little cutesy dress, you can. And again, I will link the video on the barefoot sandals as well as the headband all right family sorry for all the shakiness and stuff falling but that's that's what happens when you are somewhat live while you're recording and i did not feel like stopping this video and having to edit so you get what you get right 
So, um, let's see what else I can say. Oh, the ribbons are actually from Hobby Lobby. That's what these ribbons is for. And I kind of ducktailed them at the end like that. If you're into wreath making, you already know what the ducktails are, the little V's and the, and the bows kind of give it a nice definition. And um, these here, these are the bows too. I got from Hobby Lobby some time back, long time ago. They may still have them. And I think, no, 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 no. Actually, I got these little bows in the center. Let me see if I bring it closer. From Walmart. That's where these came from, Walmart. Walmart. Now, these here, these little um, plastic ones right here, these came from Hobby Lobby because I just bought these a few days ago. So those are really cute as well. All right, family? So I hope you guys enjoyed this show and tell as well and I hope you guys are inspired and that you believe in yourself that you can do this but these are <laughs> this pattern here is not a pattern where you can be on the phone and be running your mouth no if you definitely want to learn how to do these kind of um, patterns you have to stay focused you might have to rewind a couple of times to get it but you can get it all right family so this is SEK the crazy quilts and crafter and i will see you guys on the next video and thank you so much for tuning in and i'm sorry for all the hiccups in this video but that's okay all right family see you guys real soon thank you for watching and remember to keep on blocking peace